the sheriff's office, Fish and Wildlife, Coast Guard, they all love the event. In fact, they try and book off for it. The event known as Sandbar Extravaganza drew quite the attention last year that could have made it the last of its existence. Partnerships between local law enforcement and the Coast Guard helped approve the event for this year after the concern of boater safety was addressed. As former corner Stephanie Tanico reports, it was smooth sailing with thousands of boaters for this Labor Day weekend. No shoes, no shirt, no problem. Thousands of boaters in Southwest Florida are kicking off what some say is one of the biggest boater events of the year. So big drawing law enforcement's attention last year. But enough changes were made making Picnic Island the destination this Labor Day weekend. We had someone trying to stir up some trouble and that person's no longer with that agency. The beer is cold, the music is up, and people were ready for a drama-free weekend. Blades have been fine, letting everybody have fun. Everybody's been very careful. Just a lot of good time. So with thousands of people in one spot, I had to capture it all. One selfie at a time. And as you know, every selfie needs a decent hashtag. So I asked to see what voters could come up with. If you could summarize this event in one hashtag, what would that be? Good time. Hashtag Bart's party. Awesome. And for others, a hashtag wasn't enough to sum it up. This is a great opportunity to see what Fort Myers is all about. I mean, this is a great waterway. I mean, you get to get, it, you get, to get in the water, you get to sh share experiences with like-minded people. And take a selfie to remember the good times. Stephanie Tinoco, Fox 4, in your corner.